connection to God leads to life. Connection to God is like having a garden of flourishing life. When we sever the connection with God, what happens is drought, is lifelessness. There are times in life when you feel pretty much dried up. The sources of life, they're no longer there. You're worried. How are you going to survive? Maybe not in the physical sense, but in the psychological and spiritual sense. How is God feeding you? Or better, whom or what is God sending to feed you? God responds sometimes in mysterious, unexpected ways, when we're in dire need. Trust in the Lord. Summoning us out of our comfort zone, inviting us to trust in His providence. Following not our own instincts, not our own projects and plans, but his project and plan for us. When you're in these lifeless times, be attentive to the people God is sending to you. Be attentive to the people to whom God has sent you. It's not your life and your projects, but God's project for you. We say God is love. Love isn't something God does from time to time. It's not one of God's attributes. It's what God is right through. Love, therefore, is the secret. Love is the great mystery, the hidden truth of all things. The more you give of your life, the more the divine grace increases in you. Listen to what he's telling you. Time and again, it's the summons to trust. <laughs>